Yes guys, and today we are going to be doing a soccer slash football transfer news episode and this is going to be my first episode. I'm planning to do one monthly, um, weekly if a lot of things start happening, but I'll do them whenever I feel needed, but most of the time monthly. So um, we'll go ahead and get started into this episode. There are a couple things I would like to say first. The vlogs haven't been coming because my other camera broke, so that's a problem. And the skit did pretty well. Um, hopefully it can keep climbing. Um, my latest, a couple videos back, my soccer ball video is about to hit my first video with a thousand views. So that's pretty good. And we'll just start off the episode. So basically, the first person I'd like to talk about is Paul Pogba. Paul Pogba, um, he has a transfer and he just got transferred to Manchester United for 89 million, but his agent um, is still collecting the fees. So yeah, um, so that's 89 million plus transfer fees. He just got his medical in yesterday. So that would be pretty good. Um, and there is a photo on Instagram of him and some of the people, um, trainers, and, and he is in a Manchester United kit. So that is very promising for Manchester United fans. Hashtag Pogback, that's pretty cool. Um, and the next person is Riyad Mahrez. I, I think I'm pronouncing that right. Um, but basically, if you don't know who that is, he played for um, Leicester City last year. And while he was playing, he did, um, he scored like 15, 20 goals with, alongside with Jamie Vardy out on the wing. And he, um, he did very well and he led Leicester to their first Premier League title. And it was a very good season for him, and I guess Arsene Winger thought it'd be cool to, hey, let's get him into Arsenal. And he tried for a bid of $25 million. Didn't work out. Um, Mahrez said he wanted to stay with Vardy. He wanted to win another. So that's pretty good. So Leicester fans, you should be happy. Arsenal fans, you're not happy. Um, next person is Mario Goza. Basically, he is back at Dormant. He got a um, signed for 37 million down, uh, 37 million pounds, um, which is pretty cool. But at the same time, I know a lot of Bayern fans wanted him because he was a very good um, midfielder. But the thing for Dortmund is you have your two people back. You have Royce and you have Goza. But I want to know: Do you think Aubameyang is going to go to Real Madrid? I think he's going to stay one more season, go to Real Madrid and then people are going to be mad and then he'll probably come back but that's probably not going to happen but that'd be cool if it did um so that's pretty cool Aubameyang he's probably going to leave but on the bright side Goethe's coming back in so that's really cool and basically now I'm going to move into the Olympics part because the Olympics started three days ago yeah three days ago soccer is looking pretty good Brazil is pretty much out they're doing terrible um, I haven't watched the United States play yet, but I know the women's team is doing very good. Carly Lloyd is scoring a lot of goals. Um, I'm going to have to go with Germany is going to come in first with the gold for men's soccer. And then... I'm going to put... Um, who did Brazil play last? Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, okay. But I'm going to go with Germany winning the gold. That'll be pretty cool. South Korea is going to come in fifth place. United States is not even going to come near because Michael, if Michael Bradley's playing, we're not going to win anything. But if he's not, hopefully we'll win something. But yeah. Um, so yeah. Germany, gold. Um, BPL, I'm going to go ahead and do my top five predictions. I'm going to go with... Chelsea first for two. I'm going to go mm, Manchester City only because Pep Guardiola is there. Number three, Manchester United. Number four, Tottenham. Tottenham. And number five, I'll go with Leicester just because Leicester did so good last year. You'd think they'd do pretty good this year. Hopefully. Um, Lester, if you do watch the NBA, um, it's kind of like the Warriors two years ago. The Warriors weren't so good, and then bang, they came out of, they came out of nowhere and did spectacular. That's what Lester did. So Lester is pretty much like the 
Golden State Warriors of England. Um, and then last thing on the list, um, will Lionel Messi return to international? I think he's not going to play and then he's going to come back a couple months before um, the Russian um, the Russian World Cup in 2018. He's going to come back and they're going to go, they're not going to win, but he's going to come back and try to win at least one more time. But yeah, so thank you for watching this first episode of soccer chat slash football news. Um, hopefully I'll see you in the next couple weeks, few weeks. You know, if something big happens, I'll make just a special episode for that. So, um, if you like the video, give it a like. If you want to see more content like this, go and subscribe. I mean, it's free. Why would you not do it? Um, and then, if you do want to get my other video, my um, basketball skit, to more views, I guess you can say, you can check right here. Right here. And so, that's pretty cool. Um... So, thanks for watching the video. Leave a like, subscribe, comment if you think Aubameyang's going to go to Real Madrid. Comment how many goals you think Paul Pogba's going to win. I mean, score. Yeah, and your BPL top three predictions. Thank you for watching. And this has been a good episode, and I'm going to leave you right now.